Hi guys, uh, in today's video we take a brief look at one of Aikido's fundamentals, Tainahenko. Now this is practiced in dojos all over the world so we're not trying to teach anyone how to suck eggs but we've been playing around with this and we've come up with a, a bunch of variations on a theme which you might want to have a play with. They're quite useful if you get partners of different sizes and shapes etc. So have a play with it and be, uh, be great to get some feedback in the comments. Have fun! Slide in with your front foot, keeping your hand in front of your center line at all times. Once your entrance takes you past the point of the grip, slide in little toe to little toe and make the tenkan turn to complete the movement. It is critical that your partner maintains a strong connected grip throughout. By shaping your hand, you can start to divert the flow of your partner's movement from the outset. There are several ways of doing this, depending upon how you are gripped and your partner's size, shape and intention. This first variation is excellent against a very strong grip, as it keeps the movement close to your own centre and reduces leverage on your arms. Our second variation is very similar, but has benefits if you are taller than your uke allowing you to drop your weight down through your partner's balance. There may be circumstances where you wish to keep your shape fully extended. This variation allows you to shift your partner's weight into the instep of their front foot, breaking their balance as you turn. If your partner is being obstructive or awkward and actively trying to block your movement, bring your upper arm close to your body and simply pivot around your elbow, making sure to keep your hands in front of your centre at all times. Tainahenko reminds us to move through our own centre lines and not to isolate individual body parts, but rather move efficiently as a complete unit. 